Hey guys, what's up? It's the Electrical Code Coach here, and this is the Electricians in Action. You can catch the EIA every day at 9 a.m., where we get together and talk about the code before we go out and fight the good fight. Let's get to it. All right, so the question is, how deep should that conduit be? So we're dealing with burial depth requirements. And we, we went over many times 300.5, how to use the table and all of that. You could check that out on our channel. But the point that I want to get across today is never, under any circumstance, do something just because somebody said that's how it should be done. Oh, that's got to be 24 inches. That's got to be 36 inches. All of these crazy things. You guys need to know the code. If you want to be a pro, for one, it's going to save you time and money and labor. And for two, it's going to save you a lot of stress because you're always going to be wondering, well, this person said it should be this much, but is this how much it is? Head over to table 300.5. I've taught you how to read it in the past. Look at the black bolt heading first to make sure you're in the right table. Select your location from the left-hand side and then select your scenario scenario across the top and then you go down and you tee off with what your scenario is in your burial depth just never under any circumstance go by that's how much it should be that needs to be 24 inches that needs to be so much a lot of times people don't have a clue they've heard it from someone that just said it should be like that I don't want you guys to live your career like that for one it's gonna cost you time and money and on the other foot the other side of that coin, it's going to save you time and money by knowing what the actual code is. Never go off hearsay, never go off what somebody said, and never go off of I think of. If somebody says, I think it's this, right away say, oh, okay, I respect that. Let's bust out the code book and let's take a look at it. I'm the Electrical Code Coach. I want you guys to be pros. I want you to excel and be great in everything that you do in life and in the electrical industry. Let's get to it. Hey guys, before we get off here, I just want to remind you that you can do it. Just keep grinding, keep pushing. You can do this. You got this. I've got your back. Let's get to it.